My name is Grace Carroll. I'm a lecturer. I'm working in the School of Psychology and I do my research in the Animal Behaviour Centre here at Queen's University Belfast. My name is Catherine Reeve and I'm a lecturer at Queen's University Belfast. Hi, my name is Elena Macri and I'm a PhD student here at Queen's. We do predominantly applied research, so we want to make sure that our research has an application in the outside world and we focus on zoo animals and domesticated animals, predominantly companion animals, but we also do research on farm animals. I study applied canine olfaction, which is how dogs smell the world. So currently we're working on a study to examine whether dogs can detect olfactory cues associated with someone experiencing stress. And my area of study is to do with people connecting with animals in the zoo and aquarium setting. So the kind of applications of this research is to feed back to the zoos and aquariums so they can better design um, their enclosures or possibly their educational talks. At the moment I'm working on an eye tracking study. So I want to see how people with different types of personalities and different attitudes towards animals how they pay attention to cuteness. We did an online questionnaire to screen participants. We then invited them to come into the Animal Behaviour Centre to carry out an eye tracking task. Once we have the data, we can use special software to look at where people were paying attention to. This can help us understand how different types of people process cuteness or signs of vulnerability in animals and humans. Our excellent facilities at the Animal Behaviour Centre allow us to carry out experiments in controlled conditions and our links with industry and animal charities allow us to carry out research in the field. Given the range of species that we work with and the research questions that we address, you're likely to be able to find a supervisor within the Animal Behaviour Centre that can guide you in developing your research.